All right, well, I'm having a little trouble with it, so right now for this belt, I have got this driven unit all the way back so the chain's tight, okay? And I've had to raise it up a little bit with the washers to get it even, and it's still not even. I think it's spo they're supposed to be pretty well even, but this one's about half an inch or less lower than the torque converter. So that's where I'm at on that. So I may need to get more washers if I need to raise it up more. But see, I might end up hitting right here because see, that's only that much. That's not much since I got the engine all the way back. So the engine's all the way pulled back in its slot as far as it'll go. So right now, Well, I'll just start it up and you can see what it does. So you see how the belt keeps getting, it's like it jerks down into there. See, it's perfect back here. It fits in there just perfect. I mean, that's the way I thought it was supposed to fit, the way I measured it and ordered the belt. But then right here, it gets stuck in there. See, and if I pull the belt around, it'll you can get it to loosen. But as soon as you start it, it just gets tighter in there and kind of wants to jerk the cart. It doesn't want to take off, but it wants to bog the engine down, and I think that's what's making the engine die. So I'll go ahead and start it and let you see. So it doesn't look like it's pulling the belt, but it's giving it enough, enough drag that it wants to hold it, and it'll kill the engine. it'll kill it like that so um, I don't know if the belt needs to wear in if I need to hop on it and drive it until the belt wears in a little bit or what so we'll see